What is good YouTube? It's your boy Lashko and I'm back with another video for y'all man. Basically, I'm making y'all this video today so y'all can make the best shooting setter on current gen because next gen is not it for me or for anyone I think because not everyone's playing it. Anyways, let's get straight into the video. So for the position, you're gonna go for power forward for your hand. I personally want right-handed player. And for my jersey number, obviously I'm gonna go with seven because that's my birthday, so. Um, this is the most important part. You gotta pay attention right here. For the pie chart, you might want more defensive, but I'm going with this pie chart because I saw Iggy Mo will go with it. And his build is like really, really, really good. And I recommend this build wants to have a shooting center and a fast center that can go into paint and get boards too. Anyways, so you from the from the first pie chart, you're gonna count down to 17. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. It's the one with more green and less red. You're gonna click on this one right here, and then you're gonna click on the first physical profile because you wanna also have speed. Pay attention closely right here because this is where it's gonna get real. You're gonna see right now. All right, guys, my bad. I messed up the, the build, but here's this is how you fixed it right here. You get six finishing, 22 shooting, and 22 defending. This is like one of the best builds you can make, and this is the most badges you can get. As you can see here, you can max out whatever you took away from here so you can get your 23 defensive badges and tear it out. Uh, perimeter, perimeter defense is maxed out again. Lateral quickness is maxed out. So I, I basically maxed everything out on defense and I took away a little bit. Just here, pause the video and match exactly this so you guys can get these exact badges. One thing though is that you're not going to get Hall of Fame defensive badges, but I think that's better because you get more shooting badges. You also get finishing badges and you get defensive. I feel like this is one of the best popper builds. I honestly made this build and I've been grinding the badges. I haven't played parked with it yet, but I've seen gameplay and this build is amazing. So I recommend you guys make this build. For the body shape, uh, um, you obviously this doesn't matter, but I'm obviously gonna go with built. You know what I'm saying? I'm on built. For the height, people wanna go 6'9", you could go 6'8". I, I honestly, I went 6'8", because now also does like you're, you're, you're quicker, but you're also gonna be overall just quicker and fast. You're, you're gonna have a higher vertical to be able to get all the board. For your weights, I know you're gonna be like, oh, I wanna be heavy because you, you obviously, you know, you wanna uh, get boards, box outs and all this and that. But how are you gonna do that if you're slow? If, you're, if you make yourself 185 pounds, like Iggy Mo did, I saw his video, I explained it, um, you're so much quicker, and if I'm already on the top of the key, and I need to go get a rebound, I can run away quicker than the center that's already on top in the back, and I can get the rebound way quicker than him. And obviously, since we're making a short player, and he's already skinny, short, not brolic, you're gonna obviously max out his weight. As you can see, I didn't lose that much of a three-point. If anything, I gained defense, and I gained finishing, because I still got a 77 three-point, I got a 79 mid range, and that's that's at that's at 85 overall. Imagine it one. Imagine once I I start leveling up my overall and getting more and more. That's that. And right here, this is the last last thing you need, and this all depends on you. Depending if you want to either get boards, if you want to either be a rim protector, if you think that you're gonna need the the rim protector badge to help you on defense because your player is short. I honestly don't think that's gonna be a problem as long as you have your badges. But I I honestly went with glass cleaner because. I, you know, since I'm already 6'8", I have long arms, I feel like the glass cleaner position will also help me get boards on top of it. So I went with glass cleaner, you can go with you can go with rim protector if you want to be able to play better defense, or you can go with spot up shooter if you want to shoot. But I personally went with glass cleaner. As you can see, we have completed the build, it says it's going to say you have built a glass cleaner. And anyways, if you guys did enjoy this video, don't forget to drop a like, hit that sub button, it's been your boy Lasco, and I'm out. Peace.